Holiday village near Wrexham. Um, again, it's a nice little site. Uh, it's got a swimming pool, indoor swimming pool, uh, some shops, restaurants, um, hard standing pitches, uh, fully serviced pitches, some that aren't fully serviced pitches. So there's a great choice of stuff here. Um, I believe you can camp, motorhome, and caravan here. There's static caravans uh, uh, and seasonal pitches. So yeah, it's a nice little site in a really, really nice location. Uh, really quiet as well. After about 11 o'clock, it's just dead. But most of the day, you don't really hear anyone. Uh, but look at the view here from the front gate. So this is what welcomes you as you come up the main drive. Obviously, if you're checking in up the left-hand lane, anyone else goes around the outside. And as you can see there, here's a swimming pool complex. There's a little games area there with badminton court, uh, table tennis, and then there is a little arcade thing with a pool table and stuff in. I'll show you in a minute. So all this here is the new swimming pool complex. They've just built this year, which is a lot nicer than the old stuff. As you can see, there's the swimming pool. Inside, nicely heated. Seating area for you to sit whilst the kids play. It's the arcade games area. As you can see, it's ideal. Got everything that you need. Table tennis, a couple of pool tables, a few little arcade machines in the corner air hockey and a seating area so you can watch the kids spend all your money we go next door badminton which I think is a great idea next door to the badminton two table tennis tables ideal no matter the weather with the roof over it. So this is where all the shops and the restaurant are. Got a nice little cafe just here. Uh, black Sheep restaurant there. That's where we went for tea last night in the Black Sheep. Brilliant meal. Couldn't fault it. And reasonably priced. Uh, I think we all had burgers and chips and stuff and it came to about 60 quid for four of us. That's with drinks as well. Nice little cafe in here. And then look at this view that you can sit out on whilst you're having a coffee in the morning. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that.
So this is the Black Sheep restaurant that we went into last night. Let's see if I can get a bit of the menu for you all. There is a kids menu as well, which was three courses for £9.95, I think. But the servings were massive. <clears throat> so the kids were well fed. You've got in here just a little bit of the history of Plassey and what used to be here. And you've got cool little shops. This is an arts and craft shop where you can go in and paint stuff. There's a sweet and ice cream shop in there we went in yesterday, but of course didn't have my camera with me and toilets. And right around the other side is the play area. This is the kids play area. So the kids were on that for a good while yesterday. This is a good sized play area. Plenty to do for all ages on it. Keep them occupied. And it's not grass, it's like a rubbery, rubbery bottom so it's uh, good for all weathers. Then got some more little shops and stuff around there. There is a little brewery in the back of this building. Uh, unfortunately that's not open this weekend. This building just here is the uh, golf club clubhouse. Of course they've got a golf club, driving range, uh, pitch and putt on site. But you can just go into this clubhouse if you're on the site. They had the football on and stuff yesterday, beer and they do bar food and stuff. It's nice in there. So here's your main reception to come in. You've got number plate recognition. When you come in, you have to go into reception, tell them your plate when you first arrive. And you've got your laundrettes in there, showers and stuff in there as well. And this is your reception area. And then you go on up to the side. As you can see again, it's all really, really well kept. Grass always cut. The staff out all day yesterday just picking up leaves to make it look clean and tidy. Laundrette on site. Here you go. Hand washing area. The dryers, washers. An area for folding stuff up. As I was just saying, you can see how really nice and tidy it is. Here's your uh, motorhome emptying and refilling point. Plenty of space there to get most motorhomes in. Just look at that. Even though it's autumn, nearly, well, pretty much winter, really cold. It's still such a beautiful sight. 
So this is our closest toilet and shower block. And we're just up there. Yeah, as you can see again, nice and clean outside. Let's take you around the back first. And show you around here. So you've got there, disabled toilets, staff only. Toilets, toilets, sinks, trusty urinals, washing areas, showers. Caravan back off in storage uh, after a lovely weekend at Plassey in uh, near Wrexham. I uh, wanted to say a big shout out to our caravan diaries who came up with us and stopped the weekend next to us. Uh, if you don't already follow them on Instagram, check out their page at our, our, our caravan diaries. Uh, we had a great weekend, went out for some food last night and a few drinks, and yeah, it was great. Um, <clears throat> Plassey as a site itself would highly, highly recommend. It's got everything there that you'd need for for a few nights away maybe a week or so you wouldn't want to because i don't know how much is around the site uh, but for a weekend it's got everything indoor swimming pool shops restaurant bar cafe uh, nice walks golf course if you're into golf course or there's driving range just for a bit of a laugh um so yeah it was a brilliant site we'd highly recommend it um that's about it i think so we'll uh, see you on the next one thank you very much don't forget to hit the like button subscribe to us if you don't already and leave us a comment all feedback is greatly welcome and helps us improve the channel thank you